what is happening guys hope you all are doing well this is Tito and welcome back to another video of flashing custom ROMs and today we are gonna be flashing the Valdas OS based on Android Oreo on Redmi Note 3 so without further delay let's make it happen first you need to go to this XDA thread to download the ROM and G apps and move them to your phone. All the important links will be given in the description box below, so do check it out. So, as you can see, I'm on Lineage OS right now. So, let's put the phone into TWRP recovery. I am using official TWRP 3.0.2 slash 2 by the way. Now go to wipe, then advanced wipe, check cache, Dalvik cache, system and data. Now swipe to wipe. Once done, go back, go back, hit install. Now locate the ROM and GApps file. Select them and swipe to confirm flash. Now wait for the time being. Once that's done, hit reboot system. First boot may take 5 to 10 minutes, so do not worry. Here we have the cool boot animation. Now as we are booted up into the ROM, let me set it up. These are the 20 stock apps this ROM comes preloaded with. As you can see, camera is working super fine, no issues there. Now let's talk what else is working and what not here. Well, Vaulty, Wi-Fi, Pickup in Scanner, IR Blaster, Torch, everything is working fine. And I have a PC Fingerprint Scanner by the way. But we do have some twists here. At this point, we have at least 5 or more audio based custom ROMs for our Redmi Note 3. So that's great development right there in my opinion. And this ROM doesn't come preloaded with a messaging app, so I had to install it from Play Store. Vault e and data was not working from the first boot, but once we set up the access point for Geo, it's working fine after that. Here is a quick demo of setting up APN and working Vault TE. And the Wi-Fi was behaving little wonky sometimes. When I was trying to turn it on, it was turning back off automatically. But after one or two reboots, the issue was fixed. This ROM has plenty of customizations. If you are into that, watch me going through them one by one. I will speed it up.
first impressions, the ROM is at pretty early stage and the developer is working hard to make it even better. So huge thanks to him. In case you wanna try it out, you can definitely do that. I am using the latest pixel launcher here. I will give the wallpaper and pixel launcher link in the description box below. So do not worry about that. So that wraps up this video guys. Hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up button and hit the subscribe button right here if you haven't already. That's been it. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye now.